So we try to understand why uh, women are more susceptible to develop asthma compared to men. And we actually identified that the male hormones, the testosterone, is a potent inhibitor of a newly described immune cell that have been um, associated with the initiation of asthma. Asthma is very interesting because a clinical observation shows that while boys are more susceptible than girls to develop asthma, there is a switch after puberty and then women are more susceptible and develop more severe asthma than men. So we wonder if the hormones could actually modulate the immune system and uh, explain why there is this switch in susceptibility. So innate lymphoid cells, which we call ILC2s, are implicated in asthma. And asthma is a response that occurs from allergens such as pollen or house dust mite. Innate lymphoid cells produce these inflammatory mediators which drive those classical symptoms that we associate with asthma, such as airway constriction and swelling in the airways. Testosterone directly acts on ILC2 by inhibiting their proliferation. So in males, you have less ILC2 in the lungs. And this directly correlates with the reduced severity of asthma in males. Well, this discovery really opens the door for thinking about uh, treatments that are not as broad based as we use at the moment and really focusing our attention down on targeting the specific cell type that's really driving the development of asthma.